Heckler & Koch has officially started handing over the newly developed G95A1 and KA1 rifles to the Bundeswehr, marking a major step forward in Germany's military modernization. This new generation of rifles is set to gradually phase out the long-serving G36, which has been in use since the 1990s. Developed by HNK at its headquarters in Oberndorf, the G95A1 is the result of a complex European competition that began in 2017, aiming to provide German forces with a next-generation small arms platform fit for today's warfare. The G95A1 is derived from the 416 Hong Kong Dollars A8, a design with an established track record across various NATO armed forces. The standard variant sports a 420mm barrel, while the compact KA-1 features a shorter 368mm version. These rifles employ a short-stroke gas piston system and are equipped with a free-floating handguard, giving them improved performance and reliability. Unlike the G36's lightweight polymer frame, the G95A1 relies more on metal components, especially aluminum, enhancing robustness and shot precision but adding some weight. Each rifle is also outfitted with an Elkin Spectre DR optic, which allows users to switch between 1x and 4x magnification. While integration of this optic has reportedly encountered minor delays, mechanical backup sights ensure battlefield functionality is not compromised. The first shipment included 390 rifles with full accessory packages and has already undergone environmental testing in a range of extreme climates, from freezing Arctic terrain to dense jungle zones. The program, culminating in a finalized contract in 2023, followed an extensive evaluation process that involved operational trials beginning in late 2023. These included tests conducted by both Bundeswehr research facilities and active military units. Thanks to the HK416's proven track record in countries such as Norway, France, and Luxembourg, the G95A1 quickly passed validation benchmarks. Notably, the German Special Forces had already been using a close variant, the G95K, since 2020, giving the military a head start in evaluating the platform's combat suitability. Compared with its predecessor, the G95A1 offers measurable improvements in accuracy, customization, and combat readiness. Its modular architecture supports a wide range of tactical setups and accessories, unlike the older G36, which lacks the modern rail systems needed for integrated optics and enhancements. While the older model prioritized portability, the G95A1 focuses on durability and performance, particularly in challenging field conditions. This rifle rollout is part of Germany's larger defense transformation, which includes expanding the armed forces to over 460,000 personnel and updating key weapon systems. The move signals Berlin's dedication to maintaining interoperability with NATO allies while reinforcing its role in collective European security. The new rifles represent not just a weapons upgrade, but a broader shift in Germany's strategic posture amid growing global and regional tensions. With over 118,000 units planned for acquisition, this procurement marks a massive investment in national defense capabilities. Though the monetary value of the deal has not been made public, its scale underscores Germany's increased military spending. For Heckler & Koch, the contract comes at a milestone moment, the company's 75th anniversary, highlighting its enduring status as a primary supplier of NATO standard firearms. The adoption of the G95A1 and KA1 signifies more than a weapons update, it reflects Germany's effort to revamp its infantry capabilities for the threats of the modern battlefield. Built on a combat-proven platform and engineered for versatility, the G95A1 is set to become the core firearm of the Bundeswehr's future fighting force.